Senator Chuck Schumer has released a statement about how the political exclusive release of January 6th footage to Tucker Carlson is actually dangerous. Let's get into the actual statement itself. Dear colleague, like many of you, I was surprised to hear reports that Kevin McCarthy plans to allow Fox News' Tucker Carlson and his producers to review highly sensitive security camera footage captured in the events around January 6th, one of the darkest days in American history. Unfortunately, Speaker McCarthy, to get the votes he needed from the MAGA wing of the House Republican Conference to become Speaker, agreed to make tens of thousands of hours of sensitive footage from across the Capitol complex publicly available. This disclosure poses grave security risk to members of Congress and everyone who works on Capitol Hill. The Speaker is needlessly exposing the Capitol complex to one of the worst security risks since 9-11. The footage Speaker McCarthy is making available to Fox News is a treasure trove of closely held information about how the Capitol complex is protected and its public release would compromise the safety of the legislative branch and allow those who want to commit another attack to learn how Congress is safeguarded. And this is something to remember. This is not footage that was ever meant to be seen by the public from these security cameras. This will show how guards react, where people are moved, in what order, what their paths are. This could be used in the future for a similar attack to make it much more deadly and effective. Releasing security footage publicly reveals the location of security cameras across the Capitol grounds, making it harder and more dangerous for our brave Capitol Police officers to do their job. It also risks exposing the carefully laid out and highly guarded plans for the continuity of government intended to preserve our democracy in the event of an attack. All things anyone who would want to harm our country would love to learn. And by handpicking Tucker Carlson, Speaker McCarthy laid bare that the sham is simply about pandering to MAGA election deniers, not the truth. Tucker Carlson has no fidelity to the truth of facts and has used his platform to promote the big lie, distort reality, expose bogus conspiracy theories about January 6th. In the past, as any indication, Tucker Carlson will select only clips that he can use to twist the facts to sow doubt about what happened on January 6th and feed into the propaganda he's already put on the Fox News' air, which based on recent reports, may not even believe himself. Which yes, I don't think I ever covered it, but there are from the Dominion lawsuit, you can find it, Tucker Carlson, according to the disclosures from Fox News, does not actually believe any of the election nonsense and did it purely for ratings. Oh, that was the wrong one. Giving someone as disingenuous Tucker Carlson exclusive access to this type of sensitive information is a grave mistake by Speaker McCarthy that will only embolden supporters of the big lie and weaken the faith in our democracy. Let me be clear. The Senate strongly objects to the release of the sensitive security footage of Tucker Carlson and Fox News. The Speaker nor any elected official does not have the right to jeopardize the safety of Senators, nor Senate or Capitol staff for their own political purposes, period, full stop. And there is a little bit here on the second page. I know the Sergeant at Arms will continue to do everything in her power to ensure the safety and security of the Senate and everyone who works in the Senate, sincerely. And there's Charles Schumer. So, what does this really boil down to nitty-gritty? Basically, Tucker Carlson has access to footage that can reveal exactly how the United States government will protect itself from an attack. He could release that footage purposefully or accidentally and endanger all members of government. Or, he could just be selectively editing pieces together to tell the narrative he wants instead of the truth. 